guys, and welcome back to The Family Fudge. Today I'm sharing some different lunch ideas with you. Now you guys know what I like to feed my toddler for lunch. You know what I like to feed my school-aged kids. And I've already shared what I like to eat for lunch. But when it comes to my husband, he's a different story. He's not very picky and he likes to eat leftovers. So today I'm actually turning some leftovers into lunches. First up, I have lunch number one, which is going to start with some leftover steak. Now, I actually don't eat very much steak. This is something that he made himself, and so it's perfect for him to have as leftovers. To go along with that, I'm also gonna put in some steamed broccoli. I'm also putting in some leftover grilled asparagus, and then I'm also giving him a lot of this tomato salad. This is something that he definitely enjoys more than I do. It's just cherry tomatoes, balsamic vinegar, a little bit of salt and pepper, and basil pesto. Next up, I have lunch number two, which is starting with some leftover pineapple sausage. I get these at Costco, and everyone in the family loves them. Except for me, I'm not a big fan. To go along with that, I'm also throwing in some brazi bites. These are a Brazilian cheese bread, and they're actually gluten-free. They're really tasty. In this back section, I'm going to put some hummus, and to go along with that, I'm also going to put in as many carrots as I can. They'll be perfect for dipping in the hummus. And then lastly, I'm going to go ahead and split this last section and put some grapes and some blueberries. My husband is definitely a big fan of fruit. For this next lunch, I'm starting with lots of celery. And to go along with that, I'm going to put some peanut butter and raisins for dipping. That's kind of like a deconstructed ants on a log. I'm also gonna include some sweet potato crackers and some leftover lunch meat. Now he's gluten-free, so I'm not gonna include bread with this. It's just turkey and ham together. And then also I'm gonna throw in some broccoli and some leftover sweet potato. Next up is lunch number four. For this lunch, I'm starting with some gluten-free sweet potato crackers. And then I'm also going to include some of this really yummy salsa and some sour cream so you can dip his little crackers in there. It seems like a different combination, but I know he'll love it. Next, I'm gonna add a few of these veggie bites. I get these at Costco and there's sweet potato and carrots and onions in there. And then in this last section, I'm going to to add as much chopped salad as I can fit. And then in this little container, I have some barbecue ranch dressing. Let me know in the comments down below if you pack lunch for your significant other, what kind of foods do you pack? Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.